Batla House, whispers of encounter 11 years back. Nearly 11 years ago, after two suspected terrorists were killed, gunned down by the special cell of Delhi police in an encounter in the Batla House area of Jamia Nagar in Delhi, people in the locality still talk about it in hushed tones. On a hot, humid Friday afternoon, locals occupied the lane in front of L18, the building where five suspected terrorists were holed up inside a flat to offer the Jumma Namaz. They talked in whispers, if at all, about the incident. According to occupants of other flats in the building, no one has ever lived in the flat ever since the encounter 11 years ago. Apart from two suspected terrorists, an inspector of the special cell, Mohan Chand Sharma, was also killed in the crossfire. During the Jumma Namaz on Friday, it seemed an entire community had blocked the lane leading to L block near the local Khalilullah Masjid. L18, the four-story building where the encounter took place, has its outer door made of iron grills. It was a huge parking space on the ground floor and towards the left corner on the opposite side is the entrance to the L-shaped staircase leading up to fourth floor. The outer walls on each floor along the staircase leading to the fourth floor had been identically painted in off-white and yellowish brown. The flat in which these five suspected terrorists had been holed up was lying vacant and its gate locked from outside. A woman living in the opposite flat refused to come out as she spoke peeping through the half-open grill gate. We have heard a lot about this flat since 2008, the year the encounter took place, but we haven't seen anyone living there. We have never seen anyone going inside, said the women. Most neighbors, however, avoided any direct conversation about the encounter. A few young men spoke in excited tones when asked about the yet-to-be-released Bollywood flick, Batla House. They sort of withdrew when inquired about the real encounter that took place. Many among those who were offering namaz have been living in the Batla house area for generations. A section, however, claimed to be unaware of any encounter. Many others claimed to have witnessed the incident, but refused to speak up of, preferring to leave the incident in the recess of their memory. There is nothing to talk about that day. Our locality has seen bad days and acquired a bad name due to the incident. For have arranged a medium of propaganda in the form of a movie to polish their image, said Hazi Parvez, a local resident. Delhi police had claimed that the five men who had been holed up inside the flat were involved in the five serial blasts that had rocked Delhi on September 13, 2008. Apart from the two men who were shot dead, two others were arrested while one managed to escape during the encounter. Director Nikhil Adwani is also on the edge to release his upcoming film Batla House, which is the recreation of events that took place on, before and after 19 September 2008. Helmed by Nikhil Adwani, Batla House is slated to hit the theatres on Independence Day on 15th August 2019. The film stars John Ibrahim in lead role and and also Mrinal Thakur, Ravi Kishan, Manish Chaudhary and Prakash Raj in pivotal roles. Now that's all from our today's special segment. I am Unali Gupta signing off from Sense Independence. Don't forget to like, share and comment on our video. For more such updates, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon.